Kinetic store. This is the energy store associated with an object's motion. We have an equation for this, which is Ek, which means energy kinetic, is equal to a half mv squared. So it depends on the mass of an object and the velocity of an object. Now let's look at what that dependence actually is. So first of all, we'll look at the mass of the object. If we have two objects moving at the same speed, then the object with more mass will have more energy in its kinetic store. So in this case, we have mass 1 and mass 2. Mass 1 is smaller than mass 2, which means the energy in the kinetic store of mass 1 will be smaller than the energy in the kinetic store of mass 2. Next, the velocity component. If we have two identical cars, both with the same mass, but they're traveling at different velocities, then what we will find is that because the velocity of the first car was smaller than the velocity of the second, then the energy in the kinetic store of the first car will be smaller than the energy in the kinetic store of the second car.